Hello everyone! Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to help you out how to keep your skin beautiful and healthy. In this video I talk about one of three vitamins that have a positive effect on our skin and hair and many other wonderful functions as well. The first vitamin I want to discuss is vitamin B5. Vitamin B5 is a water-soluble B vitamin. The vitamin is called calcium pantothenate and gets its name from the Greek word pantothen, which means everywhere, due to its very wide distribution. If you have a burning or tingling sensation in your feet and palms, feeling like you have been sitting out, then you probably have a vitamin B5 deficiency. The main function of this water-soluble B vitamin is the synthesis of coenzyme A, an acyl carrier protein. Coenzyme A is essential for fatty acid synthesis and degradation and a multitude of other metabolic processes in the body. In modern medicine, pantothenic acid is widely used. In surgery, calcium pantothenate is used to eliminate intestinal acne after operations on the gastrointestinal tract. Vitamin B5 is used during complex therapy for withdrawal symptoms in patients with alcoholism. This vitamin helps in cell building, supporting normal growth and development of the central nervous system and is important in the synthesis of antibodies, the body's defense cells. It is vital for the normal functioning of the adrenal glands, for the conversion of fats and sugars into energy. It reduces the side and toxic effects of many antibiotics. Vitamin B5 is very effective in the treatment of acne when used in large doses, up to 10 grams per day. Bear in mind, some individuals taking large doses of pantothenic acid supplements might develop mild diarrhea and gastrointestinal distress. Calcium pantothenate is used as a medicine for various kinds of pathological conditions that are associated with metabolic disorders – neuralgia, polyneuritis, paresthesia, stress, eczema, asthma, acute and chronic bronchitis, allergic reactions like hay fever and dermatitis, burns and trophic ulcers toxicosis during pregnancy, hypothyroidism, circulatory failure, chronic pancreatitis, chronic liver diseases, hypomotor intestinal dyskinesia, non-infectious diseases of the gastrointestinal tract, such as gastritis and gastroduodenitis, tuberculosis and other infections. A wide variety of plant and animal foods contain pantothenic acid meat, beef liver, poultry, whole grains, bran, wheat germ, green vegetables such as avocado and broccoli, breviced yeast, nuts and raw molasses. Vitamin B5 is most often included in the B complex in various doses. The amount of pantothenic acid in dietary supplements typically ranges from about 10 mg in multivitamin products to up to 1000 mg in supplements of B complex vitamins or pantothenic acid alone. In the course of treatment, calcium pantothenate is used orally or parenterally, intramuscularly or intravenously. For adults, adequate intake for pantothenic acid is 5 mg. For pregnancy and lactation, AIs are 6-7 mg respectively. For children, the vitamin is usually prescribed 1-2 times a day. Dosage varies with age – 1.7 mg in infants and 5 mg in adolescents. According to some scientific data, signs of vitamin B5 deficiency are hypoglycemia, low blood sugar, duodenal ulcers, blood and skin diseases. Also, a deficiency of this vitamin is associated with numbness and burning in the hands and feet, headache, fatigue, irritability, restlessness, disturbed sleep, and gastrointestinal disturbances with anorexia. The tolerable upper intake level hasn't been established for vitamin B5 because there are no reports of pantothenic acid toxicity in humans at high intakes. However, as I said before, some people may suffer from gastrointestinal disorders due to high doses of the vitamin. The good news is that pantothenic acid is not known to have any clinically relevant interactions with medications. 
Vitamin B5 is a wonderful vitamin that is essential for building and maintaining cell function. Lack of this vitamin leads to skin diseases and hair loss. If you have problems with skin and hair, you should definitely do at least two things. Firstly, discuss with your doctor the need to take vitamin B5 and secondly, watch my next video about two more vitamins that directly affect the conditions of our skin, hair and nails. See you in the part 2 vitamins for beautiful skin and don't forget to subscribe.